Hello and welcome to my very first sketchbook tour. Um, I'm fully aware of how terrible this lighting setup is, um, but it's 11 at night and I can't figure out a better way to do it at the moment. But these are my very first sketchbooks that I filled. This one is from 2014, my freshman year of high school. And this one is from 2018, I think. Um, so first I wanted to go through this one and we'll start with the cover. Uh, the cover is truly something to look at. I have so much going on. I've got some Legend of Zelda, Alice in Wonderland. I was super obsessed with um, Checkered Vans, American Horror Story, Teen Wolf, New Girl, Jim Sturges from Across the Universe. And then on the back, I really don't know what is going on here. Like I've got Katy Perry, Jennifer Lawrence, which I don't know why, some Pokemon cards, Snooki and JWoww, I really don't have an explanation for that one, Jenna Marbles, The Hungry Caterpillar, some more Teen Wolf people, so yeah, I this is just very, very old and very cringeworthy, um, but it is technically my very first, first sketchbook that I ever did. So I guess we'll just go right into it. So in the first page, we have this little drawing, um, which was a reference picture from Tumblr <laughs> in the Tumblr days. Um, I think most of these are reference pictures. Um, this was also a reference from Tumblr. I'm pretty sure these are all Tumblr references, some just doodles. Uh, <laughs> this girl, and then we've got some little houses, which I think are really cute. I would like to try to do this new in a style of mine now, and you can see the date here, January 27th, 2014 six years ago <laughs> some more little doodles another little house doodle some super emo Alice in Wonderland drawing um, I'm pretty sure that was a tumblr reference these specifically I remember that these are on like some math homework things that I would just like doodle in class and then put them in here, which is really funny. Um, some cute little houses. This was one of my favorite pictures that I found on Pinterest, which has been my phone screensaver for six years. Um, it was a reference off of this picture and I don't know why, but it's just been this way for six years and I can't really bring myself to change it and I think it'll just always stay that way. But this was just a picture that I absolutely loved and I thought that at the time I did such a good job on it. Some little doodles. We've got Ariel here, and then some more emo sketching from Tumblr. <laughs> um, I really liked this one. Um, I wish I had the picture from where it came from, but I thought that it was a really fun concept with the little s shadow dude behind him. Jasmine whatever this is a little mermaid this was also something from tumblr or pinterest and then this one was 
I was really, really proud of. I don't know the reference picture anymore, but it kind of turned out looking like Lana Del Rey, and I was kind of really excited about it. <laughs> um, but I was really proud of the way I did the proportions and everything. I mean, that's pretty, pretty good for being 15 years old. Here's a little eyeball jail. Um, a little doodle and pen. Um, I don't know what this is, but it's horrifying. <laughs> Uh, and then this was around the time that I got really into doing makeup and body painting. So this sketchbook kind of just became a planner for makeup looks that I was doing. And this was just a random doodle that I did of like a dragon. This was like a Melanie Martinez inspired body paint that I did. Um, maybe I'll be able to insert a picture here if I can find it. <laughs> then this was a doodle that I did. I used to be obsessed with drawing like little monster dudes in pen. I don't know why, but that was just something I really enjoyed to do and just creating little creatures. Uh, here's a little octopus I never finished. An octopus cupcake I never finished. Um, here's like a spider lady. She's kind of scary. I think I drew this on an airplane, honestly. Some body paint, sketching. Some more makeup. This is when I was doing the 100 days of makeup and I was planning a Sailor Moon themed makeup look for each Sailor Scout. And then this is the last sketch in here. I didn't finish it, but um, yeah, so that was the first sketchbook I ever really did. <laughs> then we have this sketchbook which I started, um, I think, two, one or two years ago when I sort of rediscovered my love for art when I was living in New Zealand. And so this was the first one I bought there and just to kind of doodle in my spare time. Um, there, these are like some tattoo ideas I was kind of messing around with. And this came out, this came off of a cigarette carton there, and I don't know why, but I just put it in there. <laughs> a bee. More little monster dudes. I really liked this guy, he was fun. I love doing these kinds of psychedelic doodles. This was inspired by a hangover that I had. Um, it's just a girl throwing up, sponsored by Svedka, <laughs> the vodka. Then I had some school stuff in here and just a bunch of doodles. The only things that I had while I was living there was a pencil and just some really cheap markers I got from the dollar store. Um, this is a true story. I cried about a cat I didn't own to my high school art teacher. So I thought I would just like take little snippets of my journal and turn them into art pieces. And that was a thing that happened. <laughs> I really liked drawing skeletons. Um, this I think was when I got home and I was feeling pretty angsty about it. Um, some more skeletons. Um, this was just like a time spender just to doodle and I wish that you guys could feel it because it feels really cool. 
This was a little guy that I got really obsessed with drawing. He's just like a little blob dude. And it says, I think my skin is on fire. Um, and I was just feeling kind of sad at the time. So I just kind of used him to express myself. Um, and then I did this guy here says no need for security I was just leaving and then I did it in a little bit more of a explicit version <laughs> where she's like this crazy old lady who like someone called security on her um, some swatching some ghosts I really liked drawing ghosts with legs and just some doodles, honestly. Not much, but that's it. These were my first sketchbooks I ever had. I know that they are nothing great. They're honestly pretty terrible, but I just kind of wanted to show them for myself to track my progress as an artist. And I guess I hope maybe you liked seeing what I had. <laughs> They're both really old sketchbooks, but I plan to kind of show my growth. And I hope that you enjoyed watching this. <laughs> Alright, bye!